gonna go dry my hair, get myself dressed, and uh, probably make a cup of tea. I'm dressed, done my hair, put my face on, and uh, the girls are settled. The older three have now got to school, and uh, my husband's gone to work. I missed that because it took so long to do my hair because it is, there's a lot of hair. So I'm gonna go and make a cup of tea now and yeah, then I don't know what. I don't know what to do. I know I've got some cleaning up to do. Um, my mum might pop in later, um, but it's really, really wet and rainy outside. So there's not really much for us to do or anywhere to go. Sunny, it's sunny, but it's raining. So anyway, I've got all this to clear up because we've been, again, moving stuff around, moving furniture out. This, I've got to clear at some point as well. So, because my brother is taking this cabinet and we're having a sideboard put there. So, I have a few bits to do. But first of all, I think what I need is a cup of tea. We need tea to start. So I have my tea and Lily is trying to convince me it is lunchtime and she's lunch. It's not lunchtime, sweetie. No, not lunch. Sausages? No. Um, let's see. What do we have? Um, we have a lot. Our fridge is fully stocked. There's seven people in the house and it is mainly vegetables and fruits, so that's good. No more sausage, no. What about, I know, what about a banana? <gasps> no, no. Apple. Apple? Well, which is it, banana or apple? Apple. Apple, are you sure? Apple. Apple, okay, we'll get you an apple. This one? This one? This one? Is it for me? No, who's it for? For Lily. lilies. There you go, sweetness. This is our, my eldest daughter, Isabella, made a request that I made some um, ham and pea soup because it is really, really bitterly cold outside. So I'm just going to do that. Um, right, so I've got my gun. It's really sloppy. It was in the freezer, so I let it defrost in the fridge overnight. And Oh yeah, but it'll be good when it's cooked. So I'm just gonna put it in in a pan with some water and boil it because the gavin I'm gonna chop up for ham and put it like to one side for lunches and the water, the stock off of the gavin I'm going to actually use in the soup. So let's go and uh, put some water in the pan. Probably going to be the most boring vlog I think I've ever done. Apologies. Right, that's just not going fast enough. Ah! It did, it just sprayed me. It just actually sprayed all of me. Right, it's in the water, so now we're gonna go boil it. Right, so we have a lily that has arrived in the kitchen. No more cookies. Oh look, I haven't switched the oven on at the wall and it's not gonna work. Excuse my face. Right, let's try that one again, shall we? We turned the, the oven off at the wall, like the electric part, because the alarm kept going off on the oven and 
we didn't know how to stop it. So in the end, during the night, we actually gave up and just turned it off. Now my camera's tipping. So anyway, that is the, that's gonna boil. And as you can hear, Lily is having a full on conversation with herself behind me. You're not having cookie. That's gonna go on a boil. I should have really tied my hair up for this, it's not really hard doing. And in here, I have, I don't know if you guys can see it, actually, let's bring it up. In here, I have some split peas that have been soaking overnight. This is just not working. One hand, I need more than, I need more than a lot of hands to get through this lot. So yeah, let that boil. Now, I think it's time that I need to clean up the living room. I'm not gonna film that. I'm not gonna, I'm not actually gonna film. I'm not gonna film myself cleaning up the living room because that would just get really boring and there's just loads and loads of stuff to pick up. We had like a really big clear out yesterday so there's just like stuff lying around everywhere and uh, I cleaned out all my kitchen cupboards which once I've cleaned up the kitchen I'll show you guys what I've done um, and just made it a little bit more organised. I just realised that it's probably like really really close to my face. Alright so I'm gonna go and clean up in there and I still haven't drank my tea so and this lighting is terrible. Anyway, I'm gonna go clean up and then I'll uh, I'll show you guys what I've done in my cupboards, in my kitchen. Just try and brighten this vlog up a little bit. Yeah. Oh. Just take my clip out of my head. I know, God knows what I must look like. Uh, so I haven't had time to clean up in here yet. I have a, let's go back, let's go back, let's go back, let's go back. I have a lily, don't we? A bit poorly she's got the sniffles so she's having some hot milk and honey and she's just tottering around but once again she takes off her clothes because she doesn't like wearing clothes I have however cleaned up my kitchen looks a little bit more human now I do have this uh, box it's, I use a like this kind of little basket box and go around and pick up all the different things that the kids leave lying around and I just kind of put it to one side and then when they come home they can go through it and see what's theirs and then put it away because if I spent the day picking up their things and putting them away I'd get nothing else done so that's the crate there got some water that I need to put away as well um, but yeah Lily's running a bit of a fever this is a little head thermometer thing but she's uh, running a bit of a fever, so she just had some medicine. And like I said, she's got some hot milk and honey. And that should hopefully break up the mucus that's in her throat. Which is such a beautiful thing. That's better. So my gammon's nearly done as well, so I'm going to be taking that out in a minute. And I'm going to be slicing it up and then putting in my peas and doing a bit there. I've actually got to find somewhere to put this. This is coconut we thought the kids would try something new yesterday so yesterday morning I found myself stood in the kitchen hitting a coconut with a hammer and a screwdriver trying to get it open they drank the coconut water which they loved but I now have loads of leftover coconut so um, I don't really know what I'm gonna do with it yet so I'm gonna have a look online see if I can find any like cool recipes or something that I could um, what am I talking what am I, what am I talking about what am I saying uh, cool recipes that I could do with it. So yeah, still haven't tried my tea. Still haven't drank it. It's now absolutely stone cold. But who could actually turn down this face? Look at her. Is that nice chicken? Is it making you feel better? Look, it's bubbles. It's bubbles. You made bubbles. You made bubbles. Go and make some more bubbles then. Oh, that is so cool. Is it fun? Yeah. Yeah? Is it making you feel better? Is the medicine helping you feel better too? Funny! She's actually watching the iPad. It's kind of like stuffed up on this big it's pile of funny. stuff here. Who is it? It's funny! Yeah, when she's poorly, all she wants to do is lie around and watch cartoons. So, and this one, I don't know if you can see her in there. She's just kind of... She's gathered up all her blankets and gone to sleep. So she's she got she's getting a bit really like really really clingy at the minute. So I'm trying not to pick her up so much. Yes, baby. <gasps> More bubbles. Bubble, bubble, bubbles. 
You like bubbles, don't you? Yep, doesn't want to talk to me anymore. But yeah, no, she um she's getting really, really clingy, so I'm trying my best not to pick her up as much, which is really hot because she really, really cries and she gives me this face and I just melt every time I see it. But I'm staying strong. I'm staying strong. There's absolutely nothing wrong with her. She's fed, she's watered, she's changed. She just literally wants to be on my hip all the time. As you can see, I haven't cleaned up the cabinet either. What am I watching? I'm looking, I'm watching. I'm watching, go on in. That is cool. You love it, don't you? <laughs> Simple things. Right, so now I'm going to go and get my gammon out. Look at the pie. I, I've been throwing things on the stairs behind me that need to go upstairs. I'm so unorganised. There's just so much stuff. I can't wait till it's all gone. Anyway, I'm going to go and get this gammon out of its pan. And then I'm going to clean up the living room. There's not much in the living room. Just need to clear that pile on the table, give it a quick hoover and uh, wipe down, wipe it down, yeah wipe the table down, I keep losing my train of thought to do and then like, me and the girls can play or read a story or something depending on what Lily feels up to doing, she's really, she's up and down, one minute she's like really excited, really, what's the word? What is wrong with me today? Energetic. She's really energetic one minute and the next minute she just kind of crashes and she just wants to lie down. So we'll see what they want to do. Um, I'm probably going to keep them in the house today um, and just like, like I said, read some stories or watch cartoons or do some drawing or, you know, that kind of thing. So yeah, I'm going to stop babbling and go and get my gammon out of the oven. Oven? Pan. I'm going to give up in a minute. I've done my soup. It's like in the pan, but it is so close to the edge of the pan. Let's see if I can show you guys. You see that? It is so very, very close to the edge of the pan. I'm going to have to split it in two, so I'm going to put it in another pan. I'm just kind of trying to balance you guys. Yeah, I'm going to like separate a little bit and put it in another pan because it's just not going to cook properly and it's just going to overflow and bubble. So I've done it, I grated some carrots, some potatoes, um, grated some onion, my split peas, my ham, or gammon, whichever you choose to call it, put it all in there with the water that the gammon I obviously boiled in, and now it's just going to cook, literally, it is now 10 to 11 in the morning, and it is just going to stay on the stove until the kids get home, so it's going to be amazing, this is like a family recipe that my mum used to cook when we were younger. My nanny used to cook it for my mum. And when it's cold outside, it is just like the perfect thing to have. It really is. So I'm just gonna, I'm just separating it into, see? Put it in some in that pan. Just separate it into like another pan and then cook it. So that's gotten good. It's looking good and the kids love it they have like two helpings of it so i'm really looking forward to that so i'm gonna put the lid on and i'm just literally going to let that cook now for hours stirring it every now and then obviously so it doesn't stick to the pan i've got to turn this one on can you still see me you can still see me this won't light why won't it light Ugh. i really really need a new oven I have a range oven and for some reason it's just, ah ha ha ha, it's lit, it's lit, but for some reason it's just not, it's not heating up like it's supposed to, so I need a new one, I do. So the last hour has been, my head's really getting on my nerves, um, the last hour has been really eventful, um, I keep saying um a lot. So Lily was eating a packet of crisps, not the healthiest thing in the world, I know, but she was eating a packet of crisps and when she was coughing, she took one back into a windpipe and she stopped breathing for a minute. Um, luckily, I know what to do. So I managed to, what seemed like the longest 30 seconds 
in the world. I managed to get it out. Um, she was really quite violently sick after that, but she was okay. Um, I have called the doctor and I'm waiting for him to call back just to see if we need to get her checked out, just to make sure that everything is okay with her throat. It is a little bit red in there. I did have a little bit of a look myself. Um, but she seems okay. She has since um, we had to bath her because obviously where she was sick, she it was everywhere. So I've had, she's had a bath, she's had something to eat, she's had some juice. Not all in that one hit. She, you know, there was a little while in between before she tried anything. Um, but she asked for something to eat. And, you know, she's been okay and she's lying on the sofa watching the iPad at the moment. She's watching cartoons. Um, and I think it's mainly because she has the sniffles, you know, and she hasn't been feeling well. I think that's why it actually came to happen. But she's okay. And the doctor will tell me, you know, if, it, if she needs to be checked out. And then we'll get her down there. And they'll have a look. But right now, we are feeding the Chloe. We're trying out these. Courgette and tuna rice. These are seven month jars. And now she's she's eight months now. Um, but she's still a bit tetchy with lumps. She's not really enjoying it. I think it's probably because she's teething as well. So we're just giving her some of these at the moment. Hold on a second. Putting the spoon in her mouth and something is scratching it. She has a tooth. I've just had a look. I just paused you guys while I had a look. Um, she, she's got a tooth just under her gum. It's just literally right there. It's not gonna be long until that pops out. Hi, is that gonna pop out soon? Let me show you, Chloe. Lily thought she'd come and join in. As you can see, she is feeling so much better. <laughs> ha, did you have a nasty cough? Oh, there's some hair in it. Um. So Chloe's sitting in her walker, but it is actually a feeding tree and a walker. They can't see. All they can see is your tummy. Tummy. Your tummy. Here she is. Nom nom. She's actually wearing half of this food. Mommy forgot to put a bib on you, didn't I? Did I forget to put a bib on you? And now it's all over your front and all down your arm. I'm gonna have to get you changed. Chloe's. Hey. <laughs> What's she doing? Yep, feeling loads better, I think. Huh? Feeling loads better. <laughs> what do you think, Chloe? What do you think? I'm num 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 num. Mmm. I'm num num num. Is that nice? Is it nice? Lily, where are your clothes gone? Your belly. Your tail? You don't got a tail. You haven't got a tail. What's your seat, Chloe? You haven't got a tail. There's a tail. Chloe's got a tail. This is a splash. A splash. So we've got a tail and we're making a splash. That's different, isn't it? I've never heard that one before. Yes! Yeah. Are you a little bit of a banana head? Nom, 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 nom. Blast! Blast? Blast who? They don't want to see in your mouth. They don't want to see that. Do we don't want to see that. Right back at you. Mummy's trying to move the camera around, look. I'm trying, not doing a very good job of it. Don't really know what I'm doing. Oh, ho, ho, what's going on there? Ready, look, Lily. Watch him. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> I can't see 
you? You're too pretty, aren't you? Oh, and you know it! You know it, didn't you? You know you're pretty! That was an eventful lunch. The girls are now settled. Chloe, oh my lord, she didn't want to eat her food. She just wasn't interested in it. So she started blowing raspberries, so it was just kind of splurging out of her mouth everywhere. But uh, yeah, she's been, she's luckily she was in a baby suit at the time. She's been wearing baby girls because um, she dribbles a lot. So when I'm in the house, I just keep wearing baby girls because we were going through outfits like there was no tomorrow because she is dribbling so much. Um, and the bibs just weren't really doing anything, so. Anyway, so the girls settled. I've just made a slice of toast with some Brussels patty. I use this. This is my gluten-free. I feel like I'm doing kind of a, like a, an advert or something. Because <sighs> I'm worth it. Anyway, this is my Mighty Mini Loaf. It's gluten-free bread and it is it comes and it's literally a tiny tiny loaf of bread. It's so expensive, but it's worth it. So I've got a slice of toast with some Brussels patty on it. Love Brussels patty, and that's filled with B12, so it's good. I've already had some pomegranate seeds. Pomegranate? Pom 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 pomegranate. They're the other ones. So I had some pomegranate seeds and uh, yeah, this will just top me off. So now I'm gonna go and see what they're up to because Although they were settled when I left the room, it is really quiet, so it could mean that Lily is up to something. That means no good. So I should really go and check. What time is it, Dills? It's homework time. Yay! Are you excited? Yes. You are? It's yeah. multiplicate, multiple, multiplicate, multiplying things, times tables. <laughs> I can't and see the word. And always, my dad said, if I get my homework done every Thursday night, I, on the weekend, I get to do whatever I want. That's right. The quicker you get your homework done, the more time you have to spend on times like, uh, things you want to do. Yeah. That's right. It's getting so dark outside. Did you enjoy your dinner? They had soup for dinner. I didn't get to film it. I love it. You loved it. You loved it, didn't you? You totally loved it. It was good soup. Yay! Anyway, they're doing the homework. Um, Dad is taking Ethan for a meeting at school. Um, and the girls, Lily is asleep over there and Chloe is with Dad. So, there's not much more for me to film tonight. Which is a bit... Not very good, really. Because um, I haven't filmed that much this afternoon because I had... I mean, I expected my mum to come over for a cup of tea, but I had an unexpected early visit today, and we sat and we had a chat and looked through some Christmas catalogues and things like that, getting ready for Santa coming. So, it's not. I know you love Santa. We all love Santa. Put your hands in the air if you love Santa. Woo! Anyway, so I'm going to end this video here. I know it's a short one, but I'm. Well, it's not really a short one, it's actually quite long. But I love you guys, and if you like this video, then please give it a thumbs up. And if you have anything to say or ask, then please put it in that comment box below. And uh, I will get back to you as soon as I see it. And uh, remember, if you are new here and you are just passing and thinking, this girl's a bit daft, really, then just remember, I am a bit daft and that you really want to hit that subscribe button. So don't forget to do it before you leave. And uh, yeah, so I love you guys and I will speak to you in the next video. Love you. Bye. Mm -hmm.